All right, so what? What is? I just don't. I won't be in sewers no more. I won't be anywhere no more. Honestly. We're almost done with the chapter. It's, you're fine. Everything's fine. Yeah, this is the last sequence. We've only been stuck here forever. This should. What's with what? this bright red here. hair? Yeah. That was weird. I mean, he's a construction worker. He got caught on his way back from a rave. <laughs> Techno construction rave. Oh no. What? Wow, I, I took. What? Whoa. You just instantly that died. That was the wrong death animation for that kind of th scene. But oh. I'll See the light? It was weird because I took one step. <laughs> so like, oh look, a cutscene. I take one step. Oh, I'm oh, dead now. Oh, cutscene again. Cutscene right, so again. His, so, his, so his headlamp kept him alive? Yeah, Alright. Oh. I thought I could skip it, maybe. So you need light. Just you need a right. flashlight. Yeah. Remember I turned that on? <laughs> I've had mixed results. Do you remember? <laughs> remember, remember flashlights in the eighties? I remember. Oh god, they worked so good. <laughs> they didn't need batteries. Oh god, two percent. All right, that's not a good sign. I got this. Maybe. Combine. You're not combining. You're just fucking reloading. Everything's fine, Andrew. Just Everything's call fine. Call it reloading. Flashlight. Oh, I'm dead. You didn't leave it on there long enough. That's the right animation. Yeah, that actually made sense. Last time I just kind of collapsed on top of it. Like I, you the, know like, why? You know like why my it, heart gave out. You know why that <laughs> happened, by the way? Why? As, as we're watching cutscene, I'll tell you. So what happens is that there's holes. In, no, you just keep going the cutscene. Well, I was, I was looking for a skip button, oh. uh, like a sane person would do after seeing this three times. There's <laughs> this is the tutorial too, which. Every, every part of this game so far has been another tutorial for a mechanic that they're going to use once and then seemingly never again. Alright, so I'm just going to keep training around a lot. And all see right. if that helps. Oh god, no, it did oh, nope. <laughs> it didn't help at all. <laughs> it didn't help even a little bit. <laughs> Not even slightly. <laughs> <laughs> and this is the tutorial for this mechanic, it's never happened before. And it's like unplayable. And I don't. And I have no way of digo, I have no way of knowing what I'm doing wrong because we've never seen this before. And I can't skip the cuts. Wait, what? You're doing it wrong, apparently. How? So okay, l listen, listen here. Uh. Tell me a story, Andrew. First, I'm so excited. Get to the wait. I'm so excited to hear a story. Okay, Tell first me. get into the pit, and at this end there is a light that keeps the goo away from this end. That's the sentence. Now, hold the flashlight at the goo until it backs up as far as it can go. You just keep holding it far away and move forward because the goo is not behind you. You just have to make sure you get it all. Just move it all to the other end and then jump to the opening on the right. So am I not killing it properly from behind me? I guess not. If you do it, if you do was it that, I, was I missing a spot? Yes. So you have to make sure so, all the goo's so gone. E Expert Andrew, does it look completely gone to you? It looks good enough. It, I I've watched the Power Rangers movie. I know how to get rid of goo. It's not hard. You, you're doing good. You're doing great. Yep. Yeah, keep pushing it. Keep Don't. pushing it. I feel like we did that already before. No, you didn't. Shut I, up. <laughs> I feel like just, we really tried there, to there you go. make That's sure it was gone. That's the you need to get to, so good fucking luck. Uh, so you need to, what yeah, keep fuck? it right in that corner, and then get, there yeah. There we go. Did it. Woo! I feel like we did, like, exactly that already no, before. No, you didn't, Keith. You needed my words of <laughs> it's, tutorialism. It's, it's like you said what to do, and it magically stopped fucking up. I'm gonna read this guy Weird. from now on. <laughs> Seriously, he's magic. We need him in our lives. I honestly expected to, tw to twist that thing and then have it just kill me. Yes. Because stuff's just been murdering me this whole game. Hey, you're oh. back in here. Hey. Oh, you might want to do that. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. Yeah. Do your wounds. Get the back of your legs Feel somehow. Better. Mm, yeah. You, we, you can't yeah, reach the back. What? How do... You can't reach the back of your legs? Not like... Not... Do you have spinal injuries, not Andrew? Not like that. It's so weird. Like, he's... It's such an uncomfortable way to do that. Like, you just put it in the other hand and spray that way. Like, why would you, why would you have to purposely use one hand to do everything? Yeah, I don't know. 
Yeah, no, nothing about that was conveyed the way that I think they wanted it to be conveyed at all. No. No. You know what would have been a better thing to say? Make the goo as an entity. Make sure you push all of it back. Like... Let's make sure that this is in the favorites. There we go. What, flashlight gun? Yeah. Although that might be a bad idea. Because it always uses the flashlight then. Yeah. So then we'll also unequip you. And we'll favorite that to you there. And then I'll also equip you and favor that to there. There we go. What? Now we have a healing option, a gun option, and, and a nothing option. There's, there's always a gun option. There's always a gun option. <laughs> Every option has a gun. <laughs> what? The no. The still on. Yeah, what the fuck? Because you didn't turn it off, you just put it on your shoulder. Oh, god damn it. How do you turn off flashlights, though? Uh, I don't know. Good question. I guess maybe I press left bumper until it goes to the flashlight. Do you and hold then I LB? hit left trigger? No. Left trigger is how I use all the other items. Hold LB? No, it just goes on my shoulder. I guess we'll just use batteries for the rest of the game. I don't know. <laughs> I Yeah, I can't tell you. I have, um, I have not played a game this unintuitive in a long time. Look, this is why I couldn't beat it. Look at this bastard. Yeah. He just sticks around. That's what I'm saying. You have to make sure all the goo's gone. Is... Nice try, goo suck. What? Wait, that just literally vanished. Yeah. Like the goo is so persistent and not going away. Oh, no, 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 oh, no. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Eh, I jumped. We're good. Yeah, that's garbage. Well, you might want to have, you might want to switch to the option where you actually are holding the flashlight with you. Oh, right. Because having it on your shoulder kind of makes it a little fucking retarded. Just gotta press left bumper over and over again. There we go. Oh, cutscenes are happening. God. Well, there's something in the water, which is great, because it's electrocuted. Or? The important thing is that it, we're scared. Oh, oh! It's we're a, so it's scared a nest. right now, and we just need, need to burn it. You need to burn that nest. What if I just shoot it, though? No? Okay. Oh, my God. Hi, face hugger. Well. Uh, you know, this in particular really feels like this is an attempt at a Half-Life game, right? Yeah. There's electrified water in the sewer, and weird sphincters are shooting out things that jump at your face. Yes. Like, this is actually distressingly, like, Half-Life lawsuity, and people would probably be concerned if the game wasn't so bad that no one cared. Yes. Maybe? I mean, there's no crowbars. How do I burn you? Like, actually, how do I burn you? I assume I gotta burn you somehow. But how? Uh, oh. Maybe I stick this in... This is weird. <laughs> it's working, though. Oh, you just electrocuted it. Ow. There we go. Well, now it's the extendo thi rope. It does whatever it feels like and is apparently not hurting me. Did I kill the sphincter with it? Maybe. No. This does not control the way you think it might, by the way. <laughs> like, not even a little. Oh, now you can turn on the pipe that burns it. Yay! So, when, the whole time I was holding that, it was in, like, you're rappelling down a wall controls, instead of, like, Oh walking. my god, yeah. so they don't know the difference. Inst instead of you're walking around in environment controls. That's, that's terrifying, yeah, what that, the that, fuck? Yeah, that was baffling. Like, I'm like, whoa, what the fuck's happening to my controls right now? Oh no, it just turned off the fire. Oh. Okay. That almost seems like the opposite of what I wanted, Did honestly. You, I'm you standing know? on top of the monster. This is like, god, why? <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately, I still have to deal with this bastard. Alright. Um... There's still fire in here, right? No, we took out the fire. Yeah, there's fire right oh, there. Oh, there it is. Never mind. Just get a paddle or a chair yeah. or a whatever those Come are. Come here, horsey. Uh, horses? Yeah, there's a, there's a horse. That's like the worst name for not a horse ever? <laughs> you don't know that you don't know these are called horses? No. Oh. Why the fuck would I know that? Yeah, that's that's just what they call these. I think it's on fire. Yeah, it's like almost like a to support Wait, thing. Can you throw it in the I'm pit? curious. This seems like a bad idea. I should get rid of you. How do I get rid of you again? There we go. Oh. That actually worked. Yeah, but the light doesn't seem to be... It's not, it's not really going away from it, is it? Yeah, it is. It's like is absolutely it? fucking coiling at it. <laughs> it's hard to tell from here, isn't it? I, wonder, I, I just know. wonder how long it burns. I don't know. Uh, light. In first person. Alright, exciting light-based Super Mario Sunshine gameplay. It's such a narrow band of light, too. Go yeah. away, get out of the corner, you're gonna kill me by sneaking up behind me. I know how you do. <laughs> Here, I'm just gonna... Ah, yeah, corners that's, are agony. That's good enough. 
No, it's not. If it's not gone, it's not good enough. And it sticks up behind me while I'm trying to flash it well, on, too. Because you can't. You actually cannot get that. There we go. No. No. Oh, God damn it. Oh, shit. That's, like, on me. What the f- Fire. You're more fire. This is a real video game mechanic. Just get, like, a fuck ton of horses. Throw as many horses as you can in that pit. <laughs> or get- Oh, wait. This guy's back. Get an Weird. explosion? That- that hello, works. Hello, friend. You can't throw it, though. No, not really. Honestly, I think- I mean, where's the- ah, uh, whatever is it. Honestly, I think- can I turn this thing back on? No. Oh. Why would you? It just makes a wall so you it can't makes, get in there. It makes fire here, which seems like it'd be more useful for a starting point. <laughs> like, it would repel them away. That seems genuinely helpful to me. Can you not really throw that? Not really, no. That's weird. Yeah, it's kind of useless. Fall in. <laughs> Good enough! Um... Yeah, I don't know how to get that in a position where I'd be able to accurately shoot at it at all. Is this whole room just useless to me now? Yeah. All I did was get rid of that fire and nothing yes. else, huh? Yep. Alright. Well, shit. <laughs> and the, the AI are too stupid to come after you, This so. light mechanic is actual ass, and I don't understand how it made it past five minutes of thought. Like, look at the... <laughs> I can't look at both sides at once just to clear the landing That's what I'm saying, spot. like, you need fire or something, because the fire always keeps it away from you. Alright, well, I'm just gonna do this for a while then. Start with a stick. Stick. How do y'all feel about kindling? Yeah. Excitement. That's a pretty damn good job. All I right. mean, unless you just literally have to hold fire with you. I wish I remembered through. how to turn around fast. Uh, that's a good question. Yeah. That uh, I don't really There's know the answer There's a button that instantly turns around, but this game has so many buttons, and so many of them have questionable like, can you responses just... half the time. So, yeah, I guess I'll just make a burning path all the way there. Come on, horse. <laughs> These controls. <laughs> Oh my goodness. I just love the fact that All you right. just catch things on fire. Yeah. yeah it's kind of on fire, I guess. Good yeah, enough. It's a start. It'll work out. In the end. Yeah. Or it won't, I don't know. <laughs> I just don't... I... <laughs> Why? Why is this considered gameplay? <laughs> it takes so like, long. This is not... Alright, we got this. The other stuff's Eventually. probably burnt out. That's Yeah, that's also a concern. Is how long is... Thank you, game. Wake me I'm, up inside. I'm now standing on the fire and I'm dying. Go, bring go. Ah, oh, I'm standing. Fucking dick, game. We did it. Go away, shitty blobs. Please, I'm li I'm I'm putting my light directly on it. What do you want from me, game? Oh, game wants you to now. not use fire because it's really upset that you did that. The fuck? It's the fuck. The game's like Mondo salty at you for using fire. What the? F Do I go up here somewhere? No. Ah. Oh. Yeah, the game's Mondo salty at you for using the fire. The fuck? I don't. Is that not the entire goal? Jump on in. Oh. Maybe that's why. Maybe I need a chair. <laughs> I don't know, maybe the chair also just falls out of your hands, because the fucking 360 version is awesome! You literally, like, walking off ledges makes you drop things you're carrying, and they make a puzzle where you have to walk off a ledge in order to continue. Oh, shit. Yeah, let's try a chair on fire. Hopefully it doesn't fall out of our hands like a Butterfingers! But I, I get a kick out of the fact that the implication there is that, supposedly, we're never blinking the whole time, otherwise. Just, there, just pick I'll up just, the chair. Just drop it on purpose. But yeah, the implication there is that our character never blinks until unless we tell them to for these entire segments where we're in third person. This is so dumb. It, this doesn't. Even, this barely looks like it's working. It looks like I'm on the verge of dying the entire time. And it's the only solution. None of the other approaches work. Well, we. So what we got to deal with is the fact that this oh. sludge stuff has like conservation of mass. So if you push it into a corner, it won't go away. Yeah. Because it'll like just bunch hey. up, so it becomes what immune to your light here? at that point. Hey, man. Oh, someone, someone's, someone's, someone is we happy to see me. We were separated. Hey! You hear that? Oh! Oh, oh no, not that guy. I liked him for a bit. Oh. Put it on whoa. the fence. Yeah, I guess so. Oh, camera. <laughs> I guess this is why you use first person sometimes. Or, you could have the PS3 version and not need it. 
How do I... Just drop it in front of it? I guess, yeah. We'll see if that turns out the way I hope it does. Good enough. <laughs> they all have the same animation that wants to explode. That's great. They just overloaded the circuit? Yeah. Uh, that's not how electricity works? <laughs> I just... It's fascinating to me how proud and cocky the developer of this game was about his project. <laughs> like, he was so confident that this was a game-changer, revolutionary game. I mean, he if if it was, it would have came out in 2007. And it's so, it's so miserable. But because it came that out in 2008... Popping, by the way. It's, yeah. They only had to render one object. God, God, do you want to read that message? Do you need to read that message? <laughs> it's like an angry prompt, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that, that tree was so... Like, they, had to, they only had to render one object to the entire overworld in that moment, and they failed. <laughs> Who's it from? Oh. Crowley. Oh, the bad Mr. guy. Mr. Crowley. What? French military archives. Hello, Andrew. Read. Uh. Read your Russian voice. On the 20th of August, the 23 monks of St. Paul's Monastery were found dead in their beds. An SS squad located next to the monastery had orders to recover an ancient stone supposedly hidden in the monastery. The entire squad was lost in the operation. Strangely, one resident of the monastery was unaccounted for and presumed dead. An American who had lived with the monks for over a decade. Lacking evidence on the contrary, the disappearance was written off as collateral damage, and the case closed. Okay. That's you. Yeah, but he's just done? Yeah. That's a weird... That's a weirdly open-ended message to send to somebody, and like, not even... It's weird to just present data and not come to conclusions at all, you know what I mean? Well, it's just an excerpt. Yeah, but like, so, but it's also a message sent from him specifically well, in this has, moment. Well, he sent like five other messages, so maybe the rest of the messages are oh, cool yeah. messages. Oh, I saw the one being white and the other one's being gray, so I thought that was the only one we could click on. But oh. that's just the one you highlight. Yeah. No more choice. Oh, I gotta read all of them? Yes. I have great news for you. We have this stone, and we have him. Now let me make myself clear. You're going... You're, you're going... Oh, you're... You're gonna come to us. <laughs> that's not... Okay. <laughs> lead and lead the ritual and manipulate this stone, or you'll learn what e euphemism means when I deal with those with the words pain and terror. Mostly, the, mostly for your old friend, my men are butchers, not surgeons. You know where we are. Come mm -hmm. to the hotel alone and ready. You'll learn what euphemism means when I deal with the words pain and terror. Yeah, I don't. That's why it's like I, I don't. Know. I don't think that's a euphemism though. Yeah, it is. I think he just means actual pain and terror. I think he which means, means sexy pain, which means sexy terror. It means it's not a euphemism. Yeah, like, it's like what's, what's the euphemism? <laughs> this writing seems kind of garbage. Move, bad move, Paddington Bear. <laughs> you might want to return that marmalade. It is not good for you. You are just bear. You are no poo. And not sexy time. <laughs> You are going to know euphemism for pain and terror, Paddington. <laughs> Paddington Bear. It was my last order, Paddington. <laughs> Refusing it was a big mistake. Do you? Th who do you think you are? I do. I don't respect the hidden doors. I break them open. You will be cooperate. <laughs> what? You really are Russian, whether you want it or not. Well, you said that. That it, no, it actually. Re you will. You oh, you will cooperate. Yeah, you added that. Sorry, Your I accent thought... really added <laughs> words to the text. That's how Russian works, man. We speak different languages. They just add new words. All right, you will show us the path of light. I don't have the patience Why to is wait. He quotes. <laughs> Because it's an important thing. Like he doesn't believe it, in it yeah. even though he's killing people. Well, they're not quotes. They're just like. Uh, apostrophes. He, yeah, but like it's weird that he put it in in any sort of hyphenation. It's, maybe it's the name of a book. Like, I don't know. <laughs> and he can't do like he can't do italicized because the whole thing's italic. So you yeah, can't, like that, that's also weird, by the way. But yeah, like he's supposed to believe it. You generally don't put stuff in quotes when you're like <laughs> when you actually think it's real. You will show us the path of light. <laughs> I don't have the patience to wait. Time destroys everything. You know that, old man. Fuck you, I oh, guess. Oh, their messages to the old guy killed himself because he got his phone. Yeah. Right. But they still have the strength to destroy much more until you get the stone. Destroy what? Like, my... 
My, I don't uh, know. He's threatening somebody who's not us, so like, it doesn't really. You're just destroying my effective. understanding of euphemism. <laughs> 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 that's all that's happened so far is I've re-unlearned into a word from the English dictionary. <laughs> all right. Well, good news. Wait. So the priest's name was Paddington. It's fucking stupid. <laughs> it's so dumb. We told. We said he made a mistake. <laughs> Mister Paddington, I have convinced my superiors to grant you twice the money we discussed on Saturday. Surely this will help your research consider considerably, considering the path of light. The path of light. <laughs> I know your university will pay will not pay attention to uh, the attention it deserves. I'm sure we can reach a final agreement. Yours truly, Mr. Crowley. <laughs> Is this the new one? Like no, that's the oldest. <laughs> Is that supposed to be the one that we, we yeah, got a that's notification the for? One. Like, none of these seem relevant to what's going on around us right now. Yeah, it's all why the old man was there in the first place. Yeah. Mr. Paddington, first of all, let me introduce myself. My name is Mr. Crowley. I guess that gets really ambiguity, huh? I represent a high-profile international organization in search for a new investment opportunities. My partners and I would be interested in financing certain aspects of your research. If you are interested and would le and would be willing to meet with us, please contact me at this number. Yours truly, Mr. Crowley. Yeah, that went out great. And then they all murdered each other at the end. And he blew his own brains wait, out. Wait, we, Whoa. Oh Theo's diary. Oh, I don't want to read There's way too much text in here. I wonder, first of all, by the way, like, this guy... I like how your contacts. objectives come in. The ambulance meeting. <laughs> yeah, remember when we had that uh, uh, the, that woman was in our party earlier? I guess oh the, yeah, what happened to that girl? <laughs> she just took off. Bye. Wait, she sent this guy messages. I imagine this guy has like a froggy version of like Walter White. I mean, uh, sorry, not Walter White. Uh, Wait, go to one of his fringe messages. Guy, fringe guy's voice. I got a good voice for him. What's that? It's good. He he look he he, he looks like it. Perfect. Treating a wound. That's the only message oh, you sent to us. The only message we have is a tutorial. Uh, press uh, right on the D-pad to uh, enter hearing <laughs> mode. Then uh, choose the wound you would want to treat with uh, the left stick. Finally, use bandage with the uh, right trigger. I don't, I don't really know what that means as a medic, but uh, that's what I was told <laughs> to tell you. <laughs> Snake, look for her codex number on the back of the CD case. <laughs>